anyway, um, I've been asked a lot. I've been messaged uh, comments and just everything on how I play like mobile games on PC, especially No Limit. I think No Limit Two Drag Racing. Um, that was the like biggest question is how I play because I said that I, I play on my PC. Um, I think it's a whole lot easier, especially if you're recording. Then you can basically just record like your desktop, like I am now. Um, I actually play on a program called Blue Stacks. It's actually I got you get it from here. Um, it's it it's exactly why I use. It. I think why I download it was like Blue Stacks three or something. So they are updating and everything like that. Um, it might have been four. I'm not sure, but it's up to Blue Stacks five now. But basically what it is, is you can actually go and, you know, download different games and stuff. You go to Game Center, you can look up, you know, say, No Limit. Um, no Limit, and it should bring up kind of like, you know, anything with, you know, that in the title. You can search in the Google Play Store. You can actually go here and look it up there and you'll see you know different things so basically any mobile game you can basically get on here um now don't like don't hold me to it some of them may not be on here but basically it turns your computer into kind of like a a mobile gaming thing but anyways it is blue stacks it's um bluestacks.com you go here and download it for your pc and now i'm going to show you how basically you set up because you're probably like well you know, some games have the pedal or slide. Most games have it, so you can actually change it from, like, a, say, a slide uh, pedal or something, or, you know, a steering wheel to actual, like, arrows and stuff. And so when you change it, we'll go to No Limit. Basically, it loads it up just like this. It's so much better when you actually can play it on a PC, in my opinion, um, because, like, I don't play any of these phone, uh, any of these games on my phone. It's like a whole different account. You can make your account, or you can log into your, uh, you know, your Google Play account, or you know, your Android account, or something on here. So you have everything. But this is like a, a totally different account versus on my phone. Of course, I use this for, you know, um, recording. And then you can make it full screen. Um, that's why I'm recording. It's basically my whole entire screen. So this game is basically my whole entire monitor, which is a 32 inch. So I'm playing this on like a 32 inch versus the phone. But if you hit F11, you can go back on. Now you're probably wondering, well, how do you set up buttons so you can do it? See, I'm dragging this with my my mouse. This is my mouse. You know, you see a little cursor there and everything. I know my storage. <laughs> Apparently, I, I clicked on that. But anyways, we're going to go to race. Um, we're going to do a, just a simple test. And I'm going to show you on a lot of games, say if you hit uh, start, you got to be able to have this. Now, you could actually click your mouse or whatever with it, but then you have like your launch control over here and stuff here. That's the cool thing. You hit game control. And game. You see, we are using game control. All right, so if you open Advanced Editor, um, basically you can make it so it's like a tap spot or anything like that. So if you look, W is for the gas. That's where you tap it on. So when I hit my W key, just in a lot of racing games, it's WASD. Um, I have it so it's W, so that's frontwards. Now, up and down, basically I had that, but I actually use uh, my my gearing i had for you know up arrow and stuff i actually use shift for the launch control and shift is actually over there where the gear the the gear shift is anyways so i could just use shift so i use w and shift when we're racing and everything so we want to get out of that but if you go here you can see where my controls are so when i hit w that's my key so it's like when I hit that, and then when I hit my shift key, we'll hit W again, hit shift, it launches. So that's my launch control, or I could do my arrow, and then I let go, I hit my shift, I hit my shift again, and it, it changes it like that. So I don't really have to worry about, um, you know, doing it on a... Uh, keep or I mean on a phone or anything like that it's really good now there is a bunch of programs out there that you can use 
Um, you don't have to use this or anything. And of course, when you're recording and stuff, you don't want to see the keys on there. And you can just hide it like that. And there you go. It actually even has a photo mode. So you can take photos and stuff. But you just want to take photos. I just do screenshot. I know it's probably just a cheesy way to do it. And then I just like transform it over into like Photoshop and everything like that. But that's usually how I do it. I like doing full screen. Then you can kind of, you know, you do your thing. And it, it looks good on video. Now, you can actually, I mean, you just X out the game and stuff. Then you can load up any game that you want, whatever, and search it, download it, and, of course, you can play it like that. And then, you, you know, when you... The only thing I have found, maybe I don't have it turned on, but, like, you have to go to the actual game and upload it. I mean, an update. It don't do the actual update itself, like, automatically. There's probably some way I can turn it on. I haven't found it yet. But I do use BlueStacks. Well, like I said, there are a ton more programs out there that you could use, but I chose Blue Stacks because somebody recommended it's been to me, and that's why I've been using for all for Outlaw, Trucks Off Road, um, you know, Gigabit Off Road, No Limits. You know, that that's all. Do and these are only games I have installed. But I really like using the keyboard and stuff. It's a whole lot easier, especially when you're you're driving, because basically when I'm playing, you know, I'm just sitting here at the keyboard and everything but anyways guys hopefully that could help i'll put the link in the description for blue stacks and everything but you just go here and it's just a simple little download you download it install it to your computer and everything but of course just just be cautious because when you do go on the internet and download something you always you always have to be cautious because you know some sites always seem not what they seem but this is where i downloaded it from and it seems to be working for me but use your best judgment anyways guys hope you enjoyed the video if you did make sure you hit that like button make sure you punch that subscribe button and i will see you back for some more mobile gaming <laughs>